How's it going guys? Panther Films here and today we're going to be reacting to Season 9, Episode 13 of The Walking Dead. This episode is titled Choke Point. Got to look over it because I don't know the exact name of the episode until I see it. But, yeah, we're going to get Dale vs. Beta this episode and also we're going to have, um... Oh, that's it, and it's World Kingdom, I guess, because of the trailer. I watched the trailer last, uh, last reaction video, but... Yeah, so we're gonna get that, and last episode we had the Whispers camp, we had. We had the Whispers camp and shit like that, and Beto appeared and all that. I mean, we all know, we all watched it. I mean, why are you here if you didn't watch last episode? What is wrong with you, dude? Uh, I look like shit again, like fucking 50 million issues here. But, let's get right into it, shall we? Let's get right, let's get right. Oh yeah, if you're wondering about Gotham, Gotham will be a... Uh, It'll be tomorrow. So, bent. What? How does Dallin know sign language? What? What? Since when was that a thing? I know Carol learned a bit of it, but I don't know about Dowell. I mean, to be fair, I don't know. I don't know about Dowell. I mean, he can do anything. Even kill Glenn. <clears throat> <clears throat> These fuckers, man. These... <laughs> They're so weird. I love it. It's totally vibe throughout the season. It looks completely different compared to the first episode. Oh! Oh, the fair. Kingdom of Oceanside. Oceanside? We haven't seen Oceanside since... Episode 3? I think? Well, how many are they? I mean, you got jumped by a couple of them, but how many? Like, never underestimate how many they are. There's usually, <laughs> when we walk dead, there's usually about 500 men. Somehow. Like, the save is in, like, unlimited amounts of, out of men, should I say. See, I'm kind of worried about these two, and m more so her, just on where we are in the comics. I'm more worried about her, because I know what's going to happen. She's getting a lot of screen time. Well, yeah. I guess there we go. That's <laughs> that, that's the meaning of the episode title. Then it was great. I thought it meant something else, like revolving around. Well, I guess it does kind of revolve around Dal. Oh yeah, this is in the trailer. Good. We'll kill him first. Kill him first. <laughs> that ain't happening. That ain't happening, boy. You're gonna get fucked. I don't think the, what my theory was that Negan would come in and save him, but he's not up the cell, so that fucking ruins it. <laughs> it reminds me of like season five when Davo and Carol were doing the Atlanta. Are right. yeah, but Bait is fucking massive, dude. I mean, like I said last episode, it doesn't matter how big you are. Like, as long as Dowell is strategic in his fight, he'll win. And Dowell is pretty strategic when it comes to fights. <laughs> oh, come on, don't do that cheesy comic book shit. <laughs> There's Big Boy in the middle. <laughs> Is there any others? Yeah, there's that weird looking one. There's a guy that's just turned. My like, dog could just kill bait right now and then. What's he waiting for? It's a trap! It's a trap! Oh shit, it's a trap! It's a trap! That's a bit of a... GG, Dal. Good, good, good. I thought the dog was gonna die this episode. I'm so glad he put it in there. Here he comes. 
Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Holy oh, shit. Yo. I know he's gonna come through a wall at some point. <laughs> Don't buffer. He's gonna buffer! <laughs> no! That was brutal, by the way. What? Dog! Fuck him up, dog! Don't die, though. Oh, God, don't die, dog. Well, Henry's been stopped. He's gonna die, now. That, that... That's weird. That's weird. It's, it's in the same spot where his brother got shot, right? Where the fuck is Beta? Here he comes. <laughs> Fucking Jesus Christ! No! Oh! Look at Christ, look at the size of his knife. Hey! Okay. Knife fight. That was getting his ass handed to him. <laughs> Which was to be expected. Oh! Oh! Yo! They won't kill that off like this. Nah. Batman? Walking Dead is a, a really good with her fight scenes. Like, the Deacon vs. Uh, Vic fight, the first one was fun. It was great shit. Even though it was a little bit like, why didn't Vic just close of range with the bat. Mate, you pick up a bat, you go like that, it's faster than just going like this. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> you motherfucker! How do, how, how is buffering still an issue in 2019? What? I'm going. He's not dead. Nah. I don't believe that. Like, they didn't show it, they didn't show it for. <laughs> He's not dead. I mean, that would have been pretty shitty CGI, but we're not. Oh, she doesn't know my Jesus. Jesus. Yeah, he ain't fucking dead. Like, why would you go back here? Like, what? How far did he fall down? Fuck off, you'd be dead. But he's better. I mean, Vic. I mean, you ain't killing off Beta like that. Did he fuck up his back? Oh! Please yell. Please scream out like a primal scream. Please. Yo. <laughs> They're all way to end an episode though, holy shit. It gives us a little tease of what next episode's gonna be Alexandria, probably. Oh, Dowell and Negan! Please give us a Dowell and Negan scene. Please. And then he gets flat out of the set. We'll probably get, like, a backstory in the scars, maybe, because it's like... Dowell going back to Alexandria might open all the wounds. Maybe. I don't know, we'll see. But... Three more episodes left. I'm thinking like this season started with fucking Gregory and Oceanside is like what? It's ridiculous. <laughs> uh, that was a good episode. I mean, obviously the big talking point is probably going to be Dow versus Beta. Uh, the Highwaymen thing was weird, but it, you know I think it made sense for what the kingdom needs. You know what I mean? Uh, Obviously, they, they had the hilltop 
there just so the highwaymen, plot-wise, could save them. Uh, and then we had, obviously now Carol knows about Jesus. Obviously it's going to be off screen, but it's gonna, no, she'll still know. Uh, what else happened? Uh, Henry got stabbed, Lydia and Henry come a little bit more connected. So there's not much as a, like if you look at this episode as a whole, there's not much going on in the long run other than beta. And I guess Lydia in a way. Because like, obviously it's just going to continue whatever this story is like, you know. Obviously Walking Dead is more like it continues the story when it happens, it's weird. But, yeah, I mean, there's not much to really say about this episode other than that was a great fight. Even though I buffered halfway through, so I'm probably going to watch it again. Uh, not on camera, but because I want to watch a full fight scene without a fucking buffer. But yeah, uh, this episode should be up pretty quick. Well, I'd I say pretty quick. Give it midnight UK time. Should be should be up. <laughs> uh, so yeah, uh, I'm just trying to think. Is it, did anything else happen? There's not really like like I see. Like there's not much to really talk about this episode. It's just. Like, it's a very standalone episode. Like, you could watch this episode. You could kind of skip this episode, but you also kind of need it for the Dowell stuff. I'm not saying it's like a filler episode. No, 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 no. A filler episode would be... Ocean's Eye. Not at this season, but last... Uh, season 7, that would have been a filler episode. Like, there was no point in spending 40 minutes just with Tara. There's a bit of a... Ugh. I want, like I said, like, there's not been no filler episodes. This, there might have been some filler scenes, like scenes that didn't really need to be in there. But even then, I still think, you know, we need the occasional filler scene. I mean, we had it in Breaking Bad, for fuck's sake. You know, we had the dinner scenes, you know. So that that's good shit. I mean, the whole, the whole season seven of Game of Thrones was a filler. <clears throat> that's probably going to cause a lot of shit, but <laughs> I fucking hated season seven of Game of Thrones. I hated it. It was awful. I hope you enjoyed the video guys, and I will see you in the next one. Ta-ta, and farewell. I usually put, fuck you.